Okay, but where are the new games? Xbox and Players are now reviewing games. What's Nintendo bringing to the table? Okay, I think we're starting to get into the weak season. Uh, Poiro uh, made a comeback, obviously. But these guys are ridiculous. The, the Nintendo is going to obviously reveal the Switch 2 in June. According to Poiro, a lot of the weeks seem to be correct about the Switch 2 that have been going on for the past couple of months. But... Yeah, these people, Nintendo fans, are these people are very impatient. And I don't think we could get much more original Switch games. I think it's pretty unlikely and pretty unpractical at this point. If Nintendo is really going to focus on this new hardware that's supposed to be releasing, why would they release massive games for the Switch? And this only this review, oh yeah, we're getting a couple more minor games to hold off for the holidays, you know. Kind of like that, you know, you get a bunch of minor games that Nintendo doesn't really need to have, you know, need to reveal a year in advance, okay? You know, or something like that, and yeah, that is about this video here, so yeah. You know, Xbox and PlayStation are not reviewing games because they announced their things in advance. Nintendo is a very strange company, they get, they're they going to announce the Direct, like, the day before the Direct comes out. That's how Nintendo is. Nintendo is strange like that. They're obviously waiting for PlayStation and Xbox, of course, to announce their things. So they can avoid the PlayStation and Xbox ones, which is very strange. Nintendo still does this. But, yeah. That is it about this video here. Goodbye.